The land of opportunity, beacon of democracy, the shining city on the hill, land of the free, home of the brave, the United States of America. As a son of the heartland, grandson of an Irish immigrant, those aren't just words. My family has lived the American dream. I had the great honor to serve in Congress as governor and as your vice president. And I'll always be proud of the progress we made together for a stronger, more prosperous America. But today, our country's in a lot of trouble. President Joe Biden and the radical left have weakened America at home and abroad. The American dream is being crushed under runaway inflation. Wages are dropping. Recession is looming. Our southern border is under siege, and the enemies of freedom are on the march around the world. And worse still, Timeless American values are under assault as never before. We're better than this. We can turn this country around, but different times call for different leadership. Today, our party and our country need a leader that will appeal, as Lincoln said, to the better angels of our nature. I have long believed to whom much is given, much will be required. My family and I have been blessed beyond measure with opportunities to serve this nation, and it'd be easy to stay on the sidelines. But that's not how I was raised. That's why today, before God and my family, I'm announcing I'm running for President of the United States. We can bring this country back. We can defend our nation and secure our border. We can revive our economy and put our nation back on a path to a balanced budget, defend our liberties, and give America a new beginning for life. President Reagan described us as a shining city on the hill. And above all, he called on Americans to renew optimism and believe in themselves again, to believe in each other. Every time our nation has produced leadership that has called upon this country to do hard things, the American people have always risen to the challenge. And we will again. We just need government as good as our people to do it. I believe in the American people, and I have faith. God is not done with America yet. And together, we can bring this country back. And the best days for the greatest nation on earth are yet to come. God bless you. And God bless the United States of America.